Hey guys, welcome to this video and in this video we are going to talk about 5 features that you can still use on your Samsung Galaxy Watch Active 2 if it's connected to an iPhone. Now I have also done a video where I tell you about some major features that you lose when you use your Samsung Galaxy Watch Active 2 with your iPhone and I will link that video up either in the cards here in the description below or at the end of the video so you can go ahead and watch that video as well. So right now in this video we will talk about some major features that stay intact when you use your Galaxy Watch Active 2 with your iPhone and this also applies to all the other Galaxy watches as well. So the first thing that I want to talk about here is the ability to receive calls and make calls from your Galaxy Watch. Now you can also go ahead and uh, go into the phone settings and here you can make calls as well and then talk as well on the watch. So that's cool that stays intact. Uh, now this also applies to WhatsApp calls as well so if I'm getting a whatsapp call on my phone you will see that I'll get a whatsapp call on the phone it will be transferred to the watch and then I can accept it from the watch and then talk from the watch as well which is something you can't even do uh, on an Android phone or Samsung phone now moving on to the next fully compatible feature I want to talk about the music controls on your watch so if you're playing music on your iPhone you will be able to control that music from your watch and it has full compatibility so this feature is also not just limited to music if you're playing podcasts on your um, phone you can actually uh, control them from the music player uh, app on your watch so you can pause it play it you can go forward backward it's fully compatible you can even uh, change the volume and control the volume from the watch as well which is great so there is full compatibility when it comes to music controls now this also extends to Spotify as well if you have a Spotify premium subscription you can go ahead into Spotify sign into your Spotify subscription it's a bit glitchy right now but it works fine I've tried it before you can even download songs on your Galaxy Watch and then connect a, a Bluetooth headphone and listen to these songs uh, straight from your watch. You don't need your phone for that even. Moving on to the next feature that is fully compatible with iPhone is the Samsung health features. So if you're someone who is into tracking their activity and their health, you would be happy to know that uh, health features are fully compatible with iPhone. So if you go into the Samsung health app, you will find that everything is uh, available here. So uh, you get your goals, you get your uh, steps, you can uh, log in your food, your weight, heart rate, your floors, sleep, everything is here and then you can go and manage items and then here you can see that there are a ton of activities that you can just go ahead and track. Now if you go into the Samsung health app on your watch, you will see that you don't lose any compatibility here as well so everything is present uh, you can uh, go ahead and you can uh, you know track your activities log in your uh, food intake caffeine whatever and then if you're into uh, into competitions you can log into them as well here now if we go into uh, activity here and go in workout here you will see that all the activities that are available that you can track with your Samsung or Android phones they're available on iPhone as well so we don't lose any features here as well which is great so if you go in more workouts you will find many more workouts here too so that's good to know and uh, so that's something which is good to know that you don't lose any um, you know health related features because again many people buy these watches because they want to track their health and activity uh, and there you go we have all the heart uh, rate settings available as well so you can continuously monitor your heart every 10 minutes or manually measure your heart rate now moving on to the next feature and again connected to health and tracking your activity we have fully functional sleep tracking here as well so if you're wearing your watch to your sleep you will be able to track your sleep now i've not been using this watch regularly so i don't have any sleep data but you can go ahead into sleep section and you can track your uh, sleep data on the watch as well which is great and again if you go on the Samsung health app you have the sleep section here you can go in here and uh, 
save different settings and then go ahead and track your sleep and finally i want to talk about one last feature and that is the ability to download apps and watch faces on your galaxy watch so uh, thankfully that feature is not limited at all so if you go in discover section here you can uh, go ahead and look for the recommended watch faces uh, you can go in view more and then from here you can actually even search for the watch faces or go through the list of them and there you go uh, we get all the categories here as well and you can download these watch faces again and same is the case for apps you can go in here and from here you will be able to download uh, these different apps as well on your uh, Samsung Galaxy Watch Active 2 now you can do the same from the watch itself so if you go in the end you can go into Galaxy Store you have to be logged into your Samsung account on the Galaxy Watch app on your phone in order to do this and then you can go ahead and you can look for apps watch faces featured and essential apps and download them on your watch straight from your uh, Galaxy Watch Active 2 as well so that's about it from this video guys if you have any questions let me know in the comments or if I've missed anything let me know about that as well and I will see you in the next video till then take care bye, -bye.